Hi darlings, it's Robin here. So welcome to your daily spirit message reading for Friday. I think the date is August 4th. So hold on, I have a notification coming up, super annoying. So it's Fairy Friday. I have the Fairy Tarot and the Crystal Vision Tarot and I'm going to uh, channel a message from Spirit for you guys. But I also wanted to just, hold on. If you guys noticed, I got a new chair and it's it actually blends right into my forest themes. I, I'm just like beyond excited. I was like, oh, I have to have that chair. But anyway... <laughs> <laughs> let's get on with your reading I hope you guys are doing fabulous so let me just pull one card from the fairy tarot uh and this is the lovers true love that is long lasting choices made from the heart and a return to good health okay so um, there's three possible options for this card for you so let me just pull some cards from the crystal vision to see what spirit really wants you to know Okay, I'm getting a question here for, for you guys. Like how many of you are struggling with your health or you know that somebody in your family or your friend group or is struggling with their health, okay? Um, we do have the Page of Swords here. So I'm seeing that this is probably the meaning of the message today. Um, the Page of Swords is somebody that they really like to bring in messages but in this case it could be a really dark message okay so if you've been putting off a visit to uh, a western practitioner or there's somebody in your family that's oh i'm fine it's okay it's nothing i mean i think it is time to do that you know because you can nip things in the bud and um of course you guys know that i do believe that we can heal ourselves but there are some things that you really do need like Western medicine, like just for an example, um, I have Hashimoto thyroiditis, which is a mouthful, but um, I do need to take um, a hormone for it every morning. Otherwise, uh, things get really, really ugly and I get really, really sick. Okay, so like just don't postpone that if it's a child or even if it's one of your pets, it's time to like just really suck it up. And I think for a lot of people, um, the problem is that they think it's it's too expensive, okay? So um, there is a message here that's coming in for you. And we do have the Ace of Cups, okay? So I'm getting the sense that Archangel Gabriel is also trying to give you messages about what is going on here. Um, just really wants you to live your best life, regardless if there's something that you feel that is going on health-wise, because... I mean, sometimes it's as easy as taking like something that I take, like a hormone or a supplement or, you know, changing your diet, you know, uh, I'm getting a really specific message for some of you, especially if you're having like aches and pains in your joints and stuff like that, to maybe check out the inflammation diet, okay? And I'll go back to like my thing for a minute. Like I have to avoid certain things as well. A lot of you too. Um, and gluten gets a bad rap, but you might want to check out, like really start keeping a journal on the food that you're eating and how you feel the next day. Um, and, and see if like gluten flares up symptoms like being, um, like sick to the stomach or like cranky, like it, it really affects mood as well and can give headaches. So just start paying attention to that, okay? Because we do have the Ace of Cups here. So the Ace of Cups is like really feeling well and really feeling in harmony and stuff like that. So, and what was I saying about myself? Okay, so I can't like, even though I love peanuts, I can't really eat them, um, you know, with my condition. Otherwise, like my thyroid starts to slow down even more. So there are foods that you can avoid and foods that you can bring in to really start to feel like you're on top of the world with the king of pentacles okay so sometimes things can seem really really scary when it comes to health but it could be just an elimination diet or like taking something like, like a vitamin to make you feel like a million times better okay so the king of pentacles is just this beautiful card of being just like totally at one with the earth and feeling and that could be something too you might just need to get outside a little bit more but anyway that's all i'm getting for this reading and i'll see you guys back here tomorrow bye bye